Boys and girls, welcome back to a brand new video, and in today's video, I'm doing the SMR only on every Black Ops 2 map that I have on my computer. Like I say in the beginning on all of my videos, if you are new around here, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and turn those post notifications on. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 6pm GMT, which is UK time. My dad said to me, if I hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year, he will give me a £1,000. So if that doesn't give you a reason to subscribe, I don't know what does. I've only got 10 subscribers left to actually get until I hit that as well, which is absolutely insane. Especially recently, the growth has been phenomenal. So I just want to say thank you so much for the support on my most recent videos. On the bright side, at least the box isn't going to move. It's literally just going to stay here the whole time. On the flip side, though, there is no Pack-A-Punch anywhere at all on this map. It's literally me, the mystery box, and my brain cells. Or lack of brain cells, if that's what you want to call them. This might be the only time I say this, but yeah, let's see if I can get the worst gun in the game from the box, the SMR on the first try. That is not the SMR. Is this how it feels to be the lost one of the friend group? Because I feel like this guy just... Well, I mean... He's technically given up on life anyway because he's a zombie, but this guy just looks so done. Guys, we have now got the MSR. Not the MSR, that's a Modern Warfare 3 sniper. The SMR from the box, and yeah, it's uh, it's pretty awful. I'm not going to lie right now. This gun is terrible. It literally just took me a full mag of, I think it was 20. Was it 20? Yes, it was, to kill like five zombies on round four. This is mad. A double points. Wow, I really need that, even though I need to buy no more doors right now. So it takes three shots to the head to kill the zombie, even though that didn't actually kill him. But yeah, you get my point. Honestly, this gun is awful. How is this guy still doing this? Mate, honestly, just get a life. I wonder what happens if I run this way. Is there like something secret? Oh, I can't even get that way. I knew that. I just need to be careful as well that these guys don't blow me up when they walk on the lava. Because when you kill them afterwards, I've literally got one bullet left in my mag. That is kind of insane. They will blow up and they will kill me. This is actually kind of insane. I'm not going to lie right now. This is, uh, yeah, this is kind of mad. We're on round five and... Oh, no. See, look, this is what I mean. This is what I mean. I told you. Yep, yeah, see, told you. This is actually awful. Oh, man. What do I even do right now? I don't even know what to do. Really want to skip the round, but at the same time, I get nothing from it because it's not like I'm buying anything else from the box. On the bright side, when I move on to Buried, I'll actually be able to have perks. And a Pack-A-Punch machine now that I think about it. And now they have started sprinting on round six. Great stuff. This is just what I need when I've got 10 bullets in my mag. I have got grenades. I mean, is it breaking the rules? Probably not, so let's just use them. That did nothing, and I didn't even get a max ammo. I've got six bullets left. Oh, this is kind of crazy. I'm scared running down this alleyway in case, well, yeah, that happens. See you later, zombies. Goodbye. Still didn't get a max ammo. Okay, this is not good. I've got two grenades left. After that, I'm, well, I'm done for. Just drop me a max ammo. Oh, my God, man, please. So many crawlers, but so little hope. This is kind of mad. Yeah, I didn't get a max ammo, and I've got three bullets left. This is kind of insane. I have now got a max ammo, finally, after, well, a whole 30 seconds. I just kept knifing them, and, well, I got one in the end. I'm just dreading when I get the Panzer on Origins. That's gonna, yeah, that's not gonna be a good day for anybody. Really, an insta-kill. It's probably a two-shot on insta-kill as well, to be honest. Let's try it. No, it's not. That's a surprise, to be honest with you. I read somewhere on Reddit that it takes a full mag to kill one zombie, if you shoot him all in the head on round 15. So I'm not looking forward to getting to round 15. But I'll tell you, I'm definitely not going to do that on this map. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, then. I've just gone down. I didn't mean to do that. Boys and girls, we are on Buried right now. And I've got the SMR. This is not Pack-A-Punch, by the way. I've got this gun. And I've got this gun right here. I went into the fridge and got this gun right from there. But I put unlimited ammo on it because I've run out really easily. So honestly, I can just keep firing. Which, I mean, it's better for the video, I think, anyway. Instead of me waiting for a max ammo like I did on the last one. And also, I just thought this camo was really cool on the gun. So yeah, I just decided to put it on through the mod menu that I use. This gun is terrible on round one. Just watch this. You ready? Shots to the head. Okay, it only took one apparently. Why did that one? It took like four. I don't know. I also keep just clicking my reload button when I literally just well i don't need to do it look my ammo literally doesn't move the only reason i decided to go to the bank as well and also to mod this gun into the game is because it just saves time honestly and it gives the true representation of what the gun is actually like from start to finish i've got a real question for you though do i just skip all the way to round 30 give myself loads of perks and pack a punch this thing to really see what it's like 
I think that's a good idea. Because when we get to Origins, it's going to be really hard with a Panzer just by himself. So I think doing this now would be a really great idea. I've just got the dead shot perma perk apparently. Awesome. Let's see if it actually does something. Yeah. Okay. That's cool. I've just got to keep getting headshots. Hello zombies and goodbye. I really thought I missed that shot. How did I just lose the perma perk as well? I've literally been getting headshots the whole time. You know what guys? I'm just going to give myself all the perks right now and just put it to around 30. I want to see how mad it's going to actually get. So I've given myself all the perks, hence why they're in a really, really weird order. And I've pack-a-punched this thing, but I decided to keep this camo because it just looks really, really cool. Let's see how well it actually does. Wait, hang on. Is it even a one-shot right now? It's not even a one-shot pack-a-punched on round three. That is kind of insane. So if I shoot a zombie to the body, it does three shots on this round. So it goes based on what round it's actually on, which is kind of insane. I bet it's a two-shot with insta-kill. Okay, that's a surprise. It's not. If you are enjoying the video so far, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and turn those post notifications on. Like I said in the beginning, I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 6pm GMT, which is UK time. It actually blows my mind that they put a gun in the game that is this week. It's just, well, it's kind of mad really when you think about it. I could have activated all the perma perks as well, but I mean, that was just insane, honestly. Wait, what was that? Oh, it's like a custom widow's wine. Okay, that's cool, but no thanks because I don't have PhD. You know what? Let's just skip it to round 30. Why not? Let's just do it. How did I put it on open all doors, but this didn't open? That is is kind of insane i'm not gonna lie and we are now on round 32 yeah i don't know what to expect but it seems the round hasn't started yet or it has wait is this a round 30 zombie oh yeah he is yeah he is can you just die okay he's dead i've got unlimited grenades as well but i mean i don't really want to use it oh no oh no Please don't kill me. Come on. I'm just trying to get a little bit of a train going right now so then I can just blast them and really show you how terrible this gun actually is. I mean, just look at it. It's awful. It's literally terrible. This is so bad, man. Oh, no. I got myself surrounded. No, I didn't. Oh, my gosh. What an absolute genius. Wait, hang on a minute. I can get out of here. I can go this way because this door is open and that door's open and that door is open. And that one's open, but that isn't. So, yeah, I mean, I don't know what to say about that. I used the command unlock all doors, and yeah, it didn't. I mean, technically it did, but I mean, that is kind of what we, the zombie community, would call a door. I've got myself a little stuck right now. Excuse me, zombie. Just want to get past, mate. Thank you. Can't go that way. I remembered that. This is actually mad. I can do nothing. If you guys do have any other video ideas, because this idea was suggested to me by a viewer, I will actually do what you guys suggest. As long as it's good. If it's trash, then obviously I'm not going to do it, but I can't remember the last time. Somebody suggested me a bad video idea in my own comment section. Just die already! Just die! There we go, it took long enough. God damn, these guys are so strong. Oh, this gun is just really weak. Probably a bit of both. Guys, I'm going to be completely honest. I can't remember what I last said because my washing machine is finished. So yeah, I had to sort that out. So one of my video ideas that I have kind of coming up is using the worst perk combinations. What those combinations could be, I really... Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 please. No, 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 please just get me out, please. Oh wait, I just realized it's sorting me out. Okay, I'm chilling right now. Yes, Widow's Wine helped. So if I just sit down here, am I going to survive? It seems like it. They literally just, I mean, well, look at them. They just stand there and die. Just look. He just stands there and then they just die. How is it more powerful than a pack-a-punch gun? That is, yeah, that's kind of mad. So as I was saying, yeah, I just don't know what the worst perk combinations could be. I mean, obviously anything with mule kick really is just absolutely awful. But it doesn't just have to be on like Black Ops 1, 2, and 3. I'll even do Black Ops 4 very reluctantly, but still I will do it. And also Cold War. I've not played Cold War on the channel. I've also never played Black Ops 4 on the channel. So if you do want to see that, then let me know because I will hate doing it, but I'll do it because I mean, why not? Think I'm getting the gist that this gun is really, really bad. It's not as bad as what I thought it was going to be though, but then again, I've got unlimited ammo. You would have to actually reload in a real kind of situation, I guess. So I'm going to guess that if I had to reload and you know what, actually, let me take unlimited ammo off. I'll put it to the test. So I've turned the unlimited ammo off. I don't know how this is going to go, but I mean, they are all walking now. I'd rather them not do that. Okay, well, that just happened. Let's just get this Widow's Wine thing out of the way because it's really annoying me right now. Some zombies hit me, please. There we go. Okay, I've got no more grenades. That's good. So let's just hypothetically say that you find yourself in an underground cave and it has a Western Saloon style thing going on inside. And you've got this bad boy 
but somehow you end up on round 33. I don't know in which scenario or world that will take place in real life, but let's just pretend for the sake of it, okay? And now you've got a big train coming towards you, and you're firing away, and then you suddenly realise how many zombies are coming, and it's doing no damage, and you actually don't have a limited ammo because you took your mod menu off. This is the result of that. Just, I mean, this gun's, yeah... I don't like this. The unlimited ammo obviously helped, but when you've got limited ammo and you've got to reload, yeah, this just... It ain't it, bro. It ain't it. It literally... I mean, just look. Just imagine how many max ammos you'd actually have to get to comfortably do this. Just to try and survive. I mean, just look. It ain't gonna happen, bro. Just look at this. If you corner yourself with this, you might think if you've not used it, it'll be really good. But little do you know... Oh, no, I'm in a corner. Yeah, this thing is not helping you in the slightest. So, I don't think that the SMR is actually in Origins. I've spanned the box 400,000 times and I can't find it and it's not in my mod menu weapon list. So, I decided to just bump the game straight to round 59, use the Ballista and, well, hope for the best. And before you say it, I didn't clickbait any of you. I literally couldn't find it. I was under the assumption and told that it was in Origins and obviously it's not. And listen, okay, it's going to be fun regardless. It doesn't matter. Did I just kill him in two shots? I did. Okay, that's a good start. Yeah, this gun's going to take a while unless you can hit headshots with it. Because if you don't hit headshots, yeah, I don't think you're killing anything, to be honest. Wait, can I even kill this guy with a headshot anyway? You know what? Let's just have fun at the end of the video. I might start doing this sometimes. If you want me to, then let me know. I'm just going to start modding this right now and see what happens. So I put it so it has ray gun bullets and it shoots grenades and the grenades are cluster grenades. So yeah. Oh, wait, I've died. Okay, I knew that. Yeah, okay. Wait, I'm still shooting grenades. Oh, no, I'm going to die. Don't revive me. Don't revive me. I'm going to die. Okay, then. Well, that just happened. If you did enjoy the video, don't forget to subscribe. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 6pm GMT UK time, and I'll see you guys in the next one.